This is the Totem 180 panoramic conference camera from IPVO that we recently got our hands on. It's compact, has an elegant look and feel to it and has plenty of built-in intuitive controls. There's also a beamforming speakerphone for it that goes by the name IPVO Vocal with lots of perky features underneath. While these are good and all, but it'll take more than that to meet our standard of a reliable conference setup. So, will the Totem 180 and Vocal live up to that? Well, let's put it to the test, shall we? The camera comes in this plain looking box which we liked as most of the focus is on the product itself. Inside the box, we found a user manual with plenty of info about how to set it up and what other features we can expect from it. There's also a 6 foot USB-C to USB-C cable. Having a long cable is always good as it allows you to place the camera wherever you need. As for the IPVO Vocal, the package that it comes with is almost identical to the Totem 180. Inside the box, we found the microphone snugly enclosed inside a styrofoam shell and just beneath it is a user manual and a separate box that contains a 16 feet long USB-C to C cable. Naturally, we were amazed at how long the cable is. Now, we want to talk more about the design as there is much more to it than meets the eye. As you can see, the top portion resembles an owl which is a subtle hint of its long field of view. Then there's this switch in the middle that we could flip up or down to adjust the camera's viewing angle. As for the ears of the owl, these are actually two omnidirectional microphones that we will be testing out later in this video. Below all of these are two separate buttons. The orange one is there to adjust the field of view while the smaller red button can be used to mute or unmute the mic. The USB-C port is located at the bottom while we also found a Kensington lock on the opposite side which is there to prevent theft. But that's not all, there's even a thread underneath the camera that will come in handy in pairing it up with our tripods and camera mounts. As we hold the camera, it feels almost weightless given its 0.8 pounds of weight. With that aside, let's talk about the vocal speakerphone. As you can see, it looks like a clone of the Totem Conference camera but with an entirely different set of features. Unlike the owl-shaped top portion of the Totem, this one has an upward-facing microphone with a wind filter baked on it. The speaker holes are located at the bottom and completely surrounded the entirety of the device. There's a press to mute button at the center while we also found a USB-C port at the back followed by the power and Bluetooth buttons. We also got to see two AI buttons for the mic and speaker as well as a dedicated switch for shifting between Omni and beamforming modes. We are pumped to try out all these features so let's just go ahead and set them up. Setting up the camera was pretty straightforward as well as all we had to do was plug it in using the included USB-C cable and that's pretty much it. And then there's the dedicated software for it named IPVO iStage that we have installed and we'll be talking more about in depth later on in the video. Unlike the IPVO Totem, Vocal operates wirelessly via Bluetooth. To connect it to our laptop first, we had to hold down the power button for a couple of seconds and the Bluetooth switch started to blink. And then from our laptop, we went to the connect menu by hitting Windows plus K. And from there, clicked on IPVO Vocal. And just like that, it started to work as our laptop speaker. Now onto the camera quality and boy there is a lot to talk about. The two independent cameras that we talked about earlier have 4 megapixel sensors on each which work in tandem using the video stitching tech. As you can see, it automatically stitches to separate footage streams and created a wide and immersive viewing angle of our entire meeting room, cramming everyone in the meeting room within the frame. Even Steve at the very end was in the frame which was not possible with our previous webcam. The button for switching between 120 and 180 degrees field of view was also pretty convenient as it enabled us to adjust the framing depending on whether we were using small or a large meeting room. And then we found out that the AI integration takes this convenience a step further. The camera's intelligent system automatically managed the switching process for us and all we had to do was tap the yellow button once. In addition to that, IP4 has also included an AI stage feature which works similarly to Apple's center stage. It automatically widened the camera position when Dave from our team hopped in and zoomed in when Felicia decided to leave the meeting to go and take a break. However, one thing that we found bothersome is that the camera sometimes got too close to the participants while zooming in. Well, it's not a deal breaker but we just wanted to let you know. Then there are the omnidirectional microphones and honestly they did a pretty good job thanks to their auto noise reduction. To test this feature, we have conducted a meeting with a vacuum cleaner turned on in the background. This is what the mic sounds like when noise reduction is turned off.
and this is how it sounds while turned on. While this is an extreme case, you get the idea of how well this feature actually works. Small talks and minor sounds should not be a problem with this camera. However, we found that combining the camera with the vocal speakerphone makes the entire experience feel like a complete unit. The speaker on this thing sounded crispier and less bass heavy than our laptops, while the 360 degree nature of it came in handy for everyone in the room to be able to hear what was being said from the other side of the screen. But that's not all. The microphone at the very top was pretty impressive as well. The best part? Omnidirectional mode that captured voices no matter where a participant was talking from. Although there was a slight bit of background noise at first, but when we turned on the AI mic, the noise was barely noticeable. As for the battery backup, it was enough to cover three meetings that were conducted within a day, so that was pretty helpful as well. And last but not least, the portable form factor made passing around the mic easier when a specific person was giving an update on their project. Everything that we talked about so far can be manually tweaked and precisely adjusted through the dedicated IPvo iState software. It's available on the website and completely free to download. As an initial impression, the interface looked clean to us and most of the features were labeled at the center, just beneath the live feed. While tweaking around with this, we found that there are plenty of additional AI features such as face tracking that came in handy to inform our team lead on the other side of the globe about who was actually talking in a room filled with participants. The two separate source customization enabled us to keep all the participants on one side of the screen while showcasing a weekly report slide on the other. But what we really liked was the advanced customization for each source that we used to precisely tweak the brightness and contrast among other things. But if you find it confusing, you can just let the AI do its job. So, does the IPvo Duo live up to our standard? It surely does. We mean how often do you get to see this amount of feature packed inside of a unit this compact? On top of that, it was a nightmare for us to cover the whole meeting place with our previous camera but now with this, that problem is gone. We really love the OWL theme design and both the camera quality and noise cancelling mic lived up to our expectations. If you're in for a minimal yet feature rich conference camera for small to medium sized meeting rooms, be sure to check this one out. The vocal camera was a sweet touch as it made the entire interaction between meetings seamless. So that was all about the IPvo Totem 180 panoramic camera and vocal mic. Thanks for watching. If you found this video to be helpful, please give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and let us know your thoughts in the comment section down below. Subscribe to our channel, hit the bell icon if you want to see more videos like this on your feed.